<sighs> Let's see what we can do for this. Oh, no, so I can tap. Three, two, one, go. Hi, Inuyasha, Prism, Liam, Sinahal, Krams, everyone who's watching me at this strange hour. Oh, missed. Normally I'd um, insta-shield off the monkey in the tree. up there. With Knuckles you jump off that late because you can glide and stop immediately. With Sonic and Tails you jump off earlier. Okay. So the timer should have stopped. It didn't! Why is it displaying real time? Ah, that's why. So I never actually know until the end of the first stage which timing method it's actually using, because up until then, of course, they're exactly the same. Speaking of exactly the same, the majority of this run compared to just having Sonic by himself is, as you would expect, exactly the same. You do have those two big skips where um, having, having Tails is obviously wildly beneficial, but there are some uh, smaller ones, smaller different things that you've got to look out for as well. Firstly, uh, having Tails introduces a little bit more lag. Uh, so that's something you gotta watch out for. Um, the Marble Garden fight is done a little bit differently. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Not my strongest of starts. The real time splits might not be super reliable though because um, because I used to split in game time, I, I never really used to care where where exactly I split. Hey pigs, thank you. Actually, if you've got them handy pigs, do you want to show off the the next two emotes that are going to unlock at 50? If you guys weren't aware, Pix is my, well, I say my artist. She does artwork for me, and it's very good. Uh, that actually worked out really well. <laughs> I 
Uh, funnily enough, Inuyasha, yes. Um, that's not one of the two I was talking about. But when I get to 50, I'm also going to change that. So it's, um, neater and nicer. Uh, just, just whatever size shows it off the best is fine. My, my best run of this actually has two deaths in Hydrosity 2, so I'm always going to be picking up time there. If I'm not, then I'm restarting, so you know. Okay, so the main objective throughout the stage is to make sure that Tails doesn't spawn at a specific point at the end. The main thing I'm going to do to do that is make sure it doesn't spawn here. I didn't see the Tails, that's good. Yeah, he's not here. That's good. Should be fine. Because what needs to happen is uh, Sonic and Tails need to be in slightly different positions. Yeah, okay, it worked. And then Tails appears here. And what I'm going to do is have him kill himself and uh, break the capsule at the same time. And then he respawns there. So here, I actually don't want Tails to help me. So the whole time I'm doing this fight, I'm also holding down so that he doesn't jump. That way, at least if he tries to do the jump input, all he'll do is spin dash. Don't worry, Liam, you're not on your own. Most people don't really understand this section. Yeah. 
wait a cycle here. Essentially what's going on there is, uh, throughout all of Act 1 and most of Act 2, uh, the game thinks that Sonic's standing on one of those black wheels, oh jeez, just make the ball go left, that's all I care about right now. Uh, and, when, and when you're on those wheels, A, normally you can't get off them without jumping, and B, they increase the gravity significantly, and C, they make it so gravity can go in any direction, because it always has to be towards the middle. Um, <laughs> that results in some really silly effects when you get yourself off the wheel. I'm really glad Tails decided not to jump there. That would have been a real pain in the ass. Might have got away with this. No, I haven't. Back. Come on, come on. Right. Oh no! No! Are you serious? things to get wrong there. Seven. I cannot believe of all the things to get wrong there, it would be standing in the wrong place that undoes me. This is actually roughly where I want Tails to stand. I don't want Tails to be getting hits here.
Because if Tails gets a hit and I'm jumping expecting to get a hit, then I am then vulnerable to the next attack that comes through. Ah, okay. Launch phase 2, here we go. That's actually not too bad. Hey Riku, thanks. It's it's funny, Pix, I don't think you were here at the time, but somebody said um a little a little while ago, a couple of days ago maybe. So where's the, um, where's the MA9 rip with the Robotnik box? And I hadn't mentioned even that that was next on the list. Uh, and I, I was just all, funny you should mention that. <laughs> In fairness, most people don't remember the stage going like that. There's a lot of stages like that in this game. That's why I like doing the glitches runs. I like actually showing off the... Um... I actually like showing off the level design in the game. Much more so than the zips, but... To be honest, at the moment, like the way I've been playing in Sonic 3 lately, my form is so good that I have to give this a go. I have to give this an opportunity to, to get a really good time. Ah, yes. Yeah, any I suppose there's that too. <laughs> uh, the question I'm asking myself is should I still go for the light machine? I think I'm going to. It's actually really hard to get it with tails in the way. Because you have to do you you have to jump from quite high. Because if you don't, um, then you'll jump and knock it, and then Tails will jump again and knock it again. And that second knock is where it'll end up going, not the direction you are actually aiming for. Getting a jump off a mushroom like that is actually relatively tight. I think you've only got like... I, I, I'm pretty sure it's not frame perfect, but you may only have two frames? Maybe three? That was an unfortunate place to lose time, but we'll live.
Uh, speaking of stages that don't resemble the way they are meant to normally look. This stage is a little bit special. And when I say a little bit, I really mean a, quite a lot. I'm gonna take it on purpose. Because actually being able to see the difference in sprites is very nice here. Because I need that overbalancing sprite to be sure of where I'm standing. I don't think I've ever seen Tails fly across the screen like that trying to catch up with you. It's pretty cool actually. Tails didn't jump out. That must have been what Kitora was talking about. This stage is special in several different ways. Okay, have to make sure I don't boss right. Okay, cool. No tails, you idiot! Quite a difficult thing to do, but you have to keep both Sonic and Tails away from that gap between the arms. Oh, okay. Here comes the gatekeeper. One, two, three, four, five, six. Looks good. Right, anyway. Yes! Wow, okay. I actually got the level rat first try, that's ridiculous. <laughs> I, I probably don't need to stress it at this point, but that trick is absolutely batshit insane. Like, that that is even possible is ridiculous. But actually being able to do it in a run as well. Okay. 20, 21 and a half. 24? 
line up. 14, 20, 26. Okay, I'm gonna be waiting a little bit more. Oh, actually, I might not. This might actually be better than I thought. And I forgot to split at the right time. Because I was thinking about what was going on here. Yeah. Thought I'd have to wait a little bit. That's fine. Because it's now RTA minus time bonus though, there's no need ever to stall in the um, on the boss map. Uh, it now doesn't matter where you waste the time because it all counts the same. Try stair clip. I shouldn't have gone that way. Forgot with the new clip you actually go right at the... Ah, whatever. What's done is done now. Oh shit. Um... Still a very good Xenopolis too. Won't hear me complain about that. That's a very good time. I can't believe the bulk of my time loss at this point is in fucking launch base 1. Ah, I should have waited! That, uh, those elevators there, like the nuts and bolts in Metropolis, uh, your speed stacks on them. Oops. So if you have Sonic and Tails there, uh, they go twice as fast. Another casual first go stair clip. I said I wouldn't do this again, but whatever. <laughs> I haven't even been practicing that much, they've just been happening for me lately. I don't know how to explain it. Very glad. 
I had the stalagmite rings there. Oh, whatever. Okay, that's the scary bit. That jump there. With no rings, that's the only scary part. Um, I'm fine. Yeah. One more stair clip. Holy shit, that was actually really close to falling. I, I very nearly held left for too long. Ah, uh, never mind this split, by the way. This is me, um... This is me splitting at a different time. I, I now split at the end of the stage. Uh, so it'll make itself back up in Sky Sanctuary. Give Tails a you tried star for that. Um, okay, so we're gonna wait for Knuckles to move. Once Knuckles moves, I know that this vine will be in the right position. Uh, this isn't strictly necessary, the facing left here, but I find it helps. Wow, three in a row! <laughs> Probably should have actually forced Tails to spin dash there. I don't believe it. If it weren't for Launch Base 2, uh, Launch Base 1, sorry, I would be about 30 seconds ahead. With another 30 seconds to save in Death Egg 2. I had to do a lot of very careful thinking there as to which path I was actually supposed to take. If I had, if I had gone the other way and committed to Tails' path, I would be dead. <laughs> because, um... Because I can't have Tails fly me out. Sonic on his own, without being um, hypersonic, is no chance of getting out of that pit. Yeah. 
very lucky there not to lose the shield. Spend all that time setting it up, and then Tails jumps in and gets the first hit for you. Uh, the reason I wanted to lose the shield though is because the first thing you do in Act 2 is die. You've got to be kidding. You have got to be kidding. This is a new record if I finish. I actually don't believe this is happening. Makes a lot, Tails. <laughs> okay, screen didn't shift. So nothing to worry about here. Um, okay, the main thing to worry about here is the second phase. Um, This is a really easy two round uh, with Sonic alone. Uh, with Sonic and Tails, you can one round. However, you can also die trying to get it. And I screwed it up anyway. That's fine. That is absolutely fine. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Did that just happen? Did that really just happen? First fucking attempt. <laughs> with, with a 45 second death in launch base one. What on earth is going on? <laughs> that was absolutely mental.
Now, for curiosity's sake, I wonder what the in-game time of it was. But... But what?! I, 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 I don't know what to say, I'm speechless. Uh, uh, shit, I need, I need to come down for a sec. Uh, 